Axel versus Stretch. Lucina versus Robin. The Fire Emblem match. All right. Yep. And here we go. We've seen Vixel do uh, pretty well. Obviously, we just saw them go 2-0 over Mega. We saw them go to a game at three set against Ven earlier. And trying to get a little bit of uh, movement going there. But now Stretch is on the offensive and just oh, going to yeah. keep Vixel off stage. Going to have to continue to burn more resources. And beautiful stuff so far. Wow. Yeah, immediately out of the gate, swinging uh, Stretch here. Giving Vixel no room to set up, no room to breathe. And I almost got a shield break. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I, I really like that offstage play versus Robin's uh, recovery. It only has a hitbox at the bottom of it. So uh, yeah, as long as you position your hit hitboxes offstage appropriately, you can just keep swatting Robin over and over every time they try to get back to the stage. Like, and and eventually, they'll run out of up Bs. So... <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> and I thought we were going to see that because Stretch was doing a great job uh, catching the um, the L winds uh, as he was trying to recover high. So I thought we were going to see it, but, um, uh, you know, unfortunately we didn't. But that doesn't matter. Stretch is still going to be able to find the stock uh, with that side being the left side of the stage. Yeah, I really like the – oh, nice coverage with the roll. But yeah, I really like the choice from Stretch. He just uh, – as soon as the match starts, just apply as much pressure as possible – to Robin, like just don't give them any room to get all the projectile game going. Oh, oh. my God, the book almost killing. Crazy. <laughs> if we got a book kill, that would have been insane. Yeah. I think the strongest knockback book is the uh, Nosferatu one, actually. Yeah, but Nosferatu. I didn't realize the books had different knockback. This is the first time I've heard about this. Yeah. Specifically, Nosferatu, I think, has the highest knockback with um, Elwyn. El Elwyn being second to that. But catching, <laughs> no. El catching Elwyn is actually really hard. <laughs> wow, okay then. Um, I, I just learned something today. <laughs> yeah. That's why you see a lot of Robin players are not... They're fine with uh, throwing out the Nosferatu. Because I think it only has like three uses. And then you can throw the book for like a ton of damage and knock back. Damn. Okay, well then. I learned something today. But so far right now, Stretch is continuing to apply this pressure. Yeah. Great chase there with the down smash. Take out that second stock. Stretch's looking very good right now. Yeah. I wonder if Stretch has played uh, with Jules Robin. I'm just saying because, like, as soon as his match started, like, he had no qualms, like, you know, just immediately getting comfortable in the match. Just has a lot of confidence. That yeah. hasn't really changed so far in, uh, you know, his second stock either. I can definitely see that for Stretch particularly, just being close to that region. Even if you haven't played against Jewel formerly off online, like catching the character or the player online from Jewel will definitely be something common because of that region that Stretch is from. Yeah. Okay, arc fire at the ledge. Nice patience. No neutral get up into the fires. He's going to wait out the hitbox and uh, gets on stage pretty easily. Like any percent he gets at this point is just, is just good for Ooh. him. Yeah, unfortunately, Vixel got a little too uh, jumpy there throughout the up smash way too early. Oh. Not going to be able to get a stock of it. Almost paying for a stock with their own. Uh, that up smash barely missing. Tech chase again? Nope. Not going to get the uh, tech chase down smash this time. But again, Vixel has not teched a single down to almost gets another shield break on the platform. Oh. Yeah. Directional air dodge. Not working out for for Vixel. that's kind of rough you don't you want to go out on your last stock to sd like that was that a miss input that air dodge yeah yeah remember? yeah usually that situation happens because some players input the tech situation because you can air dodge towards the stage and you're gonna tech mm -hmm. especially if you get into situations off stage like that so it's it's a common option as a reaction that people do with. especially in the online space i have suffered from it myself very very much but uh, as we go into the next match, guys, of course, you guys are probably seeing that Red Bull logo right there. Want to give a special shout out to Red Bull. Definitely helping 2G Gaming, supporting them. I'm going to go just go ahead and send a tweet for you guys. We're excited to announce two online events in the coming weeks. Look forward to open lobbies with Smash Bros. Ultimate Pros and an upcoming West Coast Invitational. Shout outs to at Red Bull Gaming for making this possible. So yeah, 2GG and Red Bull are collaborating for some upcoming events. 
honestly, that's why you guys seen the logo. Uh, but also me as a fan of energy drinks, because I happen to wake up at five in the morning every day. Uh, definitely crack open a Red Bull when you need to study for school, but also when you need that extra boost of energy. I can definitely te attest to the Red Bull being one of my favorite energy drinks whenever I drink one. Yeah, I don't know. This is really like working with Red Bull in general. Agreed. Even. They're uh, very professional. They really care about the Smash community as well. So uh, yeah, it's cool that uh, doing another event with, with Red Bull. It's always a good time. But um, going into this game, I like I like Town just because he needs. I feel like he needs a little bit more space because Stretch just had no problems getting in in his face and just you know shutting down his camping uh, tools really hard. So I think having a little bit more room to get set up will help Big Squad a lot. I mean, we'll, we'll see, because, like, they had a lot of room over on PS2 as well. Uh, if anything, okay, not going to get the kill there. So if anything, Vix will be able to find some kills earlier, which is definitely what I thought what the problem was for PS2. Did they just Z-drop yep. the Levin Sword they, and get the kill? <laughs> yes, they did. I, I haven't seen that one before. I'll tell you that. Well, I mean, I, I guess it's, oh. uh, it's time for a lot of new stuff. Ooh, man. All right, all right. But yeah, no, that's what I thought the, problem, the biggest problem was in game one is that Vixel was struggling to get some kills. Because, uh, like, it's PS2 and Town and City are, like, the same stage, right? Or not the same stage. They're the same size, right? I think Town might be slightly bigger. Okay. Town has... Well, sorry, which stage are we talking about, guys? Sorry, uh, <laughs> Town and PS2. They're roughly the same size. Um, I think. Town, Town, Town has bigger blast zones on the ceiling. Mm-hmm. I just meant the actual stage itself. Oh, okay. The yeah. town is slightly bigger. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. Oh. Chill break. It's barely missing. Stretch does a really good job of actually placing Shield Breaker in, uh, in quite a few key moments. Like, there's actually a couple times. Great uh, down smash, by the way. There's actually a few times uh, where you'll see him off stage and he'll throw it out there just as an option. Just to see if he can catch you on your shield uh, as he's recovering. It, it's actually kind of wild. Yeah, yeah, it's actually really scary too to challenge it as well. So a lot of times, Lucina just gets to get the ledge for free because if you try to challenge it, you're probably going to get blown up for it. Mm -hmm. But again, nice catch there from Vixel. Definitely having a much better time in this game too. He's just really starting to uh, punish Stretch for, you know, holding forward, which is something he wasn't able to do in the first game. Yeah. Oh. Nope, nope, nope. Oh. Oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. I think it's just us. Uh oh, uh -oh. yeah, it might just be us, guys. It might just be us. Let's see. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's, 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 it's okay. us. It's us. That's, that's fine. I'd rather it, we get disconnected than the players. <laughs> and it's actually crazy because specifically, this was an issue that was supposed to resolve as of this current patch. It was actually yeah. in the patch notes. Yeah, I remember reading it, but uh, I guess they still got fixed. Twenty dollars a year. <laughs> you know what? If they actually just upped it to like fifty dollars a year, but it guaranteed like much better servers and connection and stuff like that, I'd feel I'd feel okay with that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I, I think I feel like uh, like. The fact that it's twenty dollars a year makes me feel like, yeah, this is this is the quality you pay for. <laughs> and, and, and yeah, you know what? it's funny because like this was the same quality of Wi-Fi that we had even before they made you pay for Wi-Fi. So all we're really paying for is just emulators. <laughs> <laughs> if you really think about it. Yeah. Yeah. All right, guys. Well, I actually don't even. Uh, I'll check the. I'll check right now from from Smash EG I'll let you guys know who won. Cause I do know Stretch has won. I believe I believe Stretch won the other one. Uh, so two O Stretch? Uh, I don't know. I'm waiting for the updates. Uh, oh none of us are watching the screen, huh? <laughs> yeah, it's hard, man. Like I'm Yeah, it's it's stretch. It's stretch. Yeah, wow. it's stretch, and that's it. Yeah, stretch will move on. Wow. Uh, no, 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 one more. 
Oh yeah, one more. Okay. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> we're, we're, we're in top eight now. <laughs> thank top you, thank eight. you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, this is. But yeah, no. Um, this is losers eights. So yep. Yeah, we're, we're top eight and that was kind of that was kind of crazy because when we left, I think Vixel was up almost a whole fresh stock. Yeah. Yep. He had a hugely. <laughs> that, that's I don't. I would have liked to see how Stretch made that comeback happen, but. You know. uh, I think Stretch streams as well, so you could always head over to Stretch's stream should another disconnection error happen. That's true. Yeah, if I, was, I think it's uh, Stretch Smash. Stretch underscore Smash. can't remember. I definitely followed his stream, though. I just don't remember off the top of my head. But we're... No, no diet. Stretch okay, underscore Smash, tech. you were right. Nice. All right, so anyway, but yeah, yeah, back on uh, Town and City. Right now, Stretch looking pretty good. 40% unanswered so far, even with all these projectiles. Ooh, great weight. Unfortunately, not going to be able to get anything else out of it. And now we're getting punished. Uh, <laughs> Vixel, yeah, that's going rough. On? That's actually Ooh. really rough. Like, he tried to play very patiently with the platform pressure, missed slightly, and then got hit by, like, 12 up bears. Like, <laughs> that's just... Yep, very now they're, uh, <laughs> they got hit by a few a few other moves after that, too, and now they're just kind of uh, struggling here. Vixel got one small opening and just took advantage of it. Great dancing blade, though. Ooh. Oh, Almost. great stuff. Man, Stretch just plays so aggressive off stage in this matchup, and uh, honestly, I agree with it 100%. I, honestly, I, I feel like people don't go crazy enough versus... Robin off stage. Right. There we go, man. Yep. Stretch is forcing these uh, high recovery options. And Vixel kind of has no choice but to play into it. And right there, we're going to see as Stretch uh, takes that first stock there with a the forward air. Yeah, very, very clean edge guard. Nice catch on the landing as well. The hitbox placement is just so oh. good for Stretch. Catching these air. Oh, Woo! my. Is he dead here? No, 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 he's, no. He's very close to dying though okay oh, goes to the, the platform yeah the platform actually saved him that platform wasn't there though it'd be a very tough oh my god stretch is smothering him oh oh, oh my god yeah stretch is playing on fire right now <laughs> oh did you see that side b1 <laughs> yes Yo. i'd be jab block to like read the roll in with the up tilt just he's just way too comfortable right now oh my goodness the juggles are just not stopping. Vixel already on his last legs here. Going for yet another downer spike. Very, very close to hitting it. Yeah, man. Uh, I don't know what happened in game two, but somewhere Stretch uh, just said, hey, I know exactly everything this person wants to do. I've got Vixel downloaded. And, man, <laughs> Stretch yeah. is definitely on fire right now. Yeah, he's definitely out for blood. Going for yet another shield break. Still living here as well, but there's the snipe finally getting that stock. Yeah, Man. but even then, 94. Oh. oh my God, stretch! It's, please take it easy. What? Oh my! Yep, that's gonna be it. Stretch just absolutely dominating game three, forces a 3-0. <laughs> over Vixel. Man, what a performance. And now, <laughs> Stretch has the uh, the privilege of moving on to Loser's Quarterfinals to take on Chunky Kong. Ooh. Dude. 